I would receive a phone call from somebody at Int Management. Sean Penn or Brad Pitt or uh, Demi Moore is at this place or this place. You need to get somebody to get her into session today. And we would be given a, a, an order with a threat. If you don't get Brad Pitt into session today, you would be assigned to the RPF for missing this opportunity. And so we would have to do everything we could think of, use every resource that we had at our fingertips to contact an FSM or you know another celeb that we knew to bring a Dianetics book to their house or to their hotel room or whatever, and then basically persuade or coerce them into trying out a session. So Brad Pitt, without ever having stepped into a Scientology building, the management said, we want him, and Scientologists were sent out to get him in. Absolutely. They would actually have their radar out of like what celebrity was where, who was on their list, and then call us, and we would be deployed to go get those people in, whether we took them out for coffee or invited them for tea or went to their hotel room with a book. Uh, but we were under constant order and pressure to do this. Did Brad Pitt ever come in to do a course, do you know? You know, he, he actually did do some Scientology services, very basic services, but you couldn't say that he was ever a Scientologist. He, he, you know, he received some introductory services. Emilio Estevez was another one that I remember receiving this order.